All right, guys. Guess what? Boom. That's right. Boom. Look what I'm riding. <laughs> Welcome to my moto channel. I am in the north side of Milwaukee right now. So, lovely city, driving, so many stoplights. <laughs> it's getting warm just sitting at the lights too. All the cars around. I love my rural country road drives, but today, super, super pumped. So I'm about seven minutes away from heading into Milwaukee Harley-Davidson and I am actually going to test ride the live wire. Holy crap! <laughs> I want to do this kind of more as a personal challenge, kind of test my limits challenge myself with bikes that I'm not familiar with, especially an electric bike, which I've never ridden before. I'm super excited, but slightly nervous um, just because it's a totally new bike that Harley has put out and I don't know, I'm just excited to, to try it out. So, I am not familiar with these roads, so bear with me. But I know I'm pretty close. I'm about two miles out. So, I am meeting up with a friend that I met over the winter. So, both her and I were um, supposed to help promote the Mama Try pre-party at the Harley Davidson Museum. And unfortunately, that event got canceled, postponed. I'm not entirely sure what the status is right now. If you want to see any of it, um, just click the link above my head. I've got just my small recap on it. Um, but I met her there, and she actually is a fellow rider and racer, too. Flat track racer, I believe. But she works at Milwaukee Harley-Davidson. So she posted on her Instagram account eh, a couple weeks back saying that they're open and if you want to come test ride the live wire you can do, go do so so I'm like you know what it's happening I'm gonna do it I've watched so many videos of it I haven't seen the bike really up close and personal I definitely haven't sat on it or even rode it so today is the day super pumped. <laughs> I know it's going to be completely different, but I think it's an experience that I'm excited to share with you guys. Have, have any of you, let me know in the comments below if you have ridden the live wire before or any other, other electronic or electric, electric bikes, electronic bikes. Is that how you want to say it? I don't know. <laughs> electric bikes. So let me know what you think, your thoughts on them. If you have ridden them before, if you haven't, are you wanting to try them out? I don't know, it's a whole different ball game and for me, it's two wheels. So no matter what it is, I wanna to try to ride it for sure. And um, with it being Harley brand and so close to, of course I live in the state of Wisconsin, um, with it being Milwaukee and Harley, I want to definitely test out the live wire. So, I'm gonna pull into the parking lot pretty closely here because I think I'm right near the highway. So let me see. Oh yeah, definitely. But uh, yeah, let's go. Hello, Milwaukee Harley Davidson. And if anybody else knows what's near here, <laughs> it's pretty funny, but unless they changed it, it was a strip club. Yep, Silk Exotic at one point. And then rock country, whatever that is. That's fun too. Okay, where do I need to go? I don't come off here down here that often, but I'm pretty pumped. That is a pretty, pretty bike. Alright, 
Let's see what we got inside. She's so pretty. Mine looks like a little baby compared to it. Get on the bike, kick stand up, turn on, power on. All you feel is just a slight little pulse and that's it. And then off we go. So cool. I can't help but giggle like a little freaking two-year-old that sees a piece of chocolate cake or something like so much fun so much fun I like that it tells you the time of day too like this whole display is freaking awesome you can connect your Bluetooth on here Sing it with your phone. It'll send you updates and alerts Ugh. on it as well. Suspension's not too bad. Better than my little sporty, that's for sure. But so flipping cool. All right, let's see if we can pull off to a side street here. <laughs> it's just so whiny. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is so much fun. <laughs> so flipping cool. God, okay, I gotta edit all these flipping cools out, but it really truly is an awesome experience. If you've never ridden a live wire before, I absolutely recommend go to demoing it out. I was like, can I rent these on Eagle Rider for my trips this summer? Because that would be perfect. So perfect. But that's a whole nother ball game in itself to try to find the charging stations. And I don't know. All right. So at last, 92. Whoa, this is cool. Or is it telling me how many miles I can ride? Because it's at 109 now. So I'm not sure. It's so smart. Smarter than my own good. That was super fun. Okay. I'm going to pull off to the side here. Turn it off. Boom. All right, give you just a quick walk around of the bike, too. That semi is really hauling it up that hill. Here she is. Harley Davidson's electric motorcycle, live wire, in orange. I think it's awesome in orange, definitely. I like the mat out. We found a beautiful backcountry road to take her on. And I don't, I don't really wanna bring her back. <laughs> Sorry, Milwaukee Harley. So much fun, so much fun. But I suppose, I love, I love the dash on it. I love how smart the bike is too. Probably should turn around and because I want to go back up that hill. It's super fun. Okay. Oh, I should put my gloves back on. 
I was taking pictures. She was too pretty not to. This was an absolute blast. I don't know how long I can technically take her out for. I mean, I didn't say exactly. <laughs> The only thing I hit is the freaking pegs on it. Okay. Let's go. Back up the hill. It feels good to ride. <sighs> I have my vents open on my jacket, but I was starting to get warm just sitting there in the sun with it. <laughs> I still have to pinch myself. Like, I'm truly riding this bike. Oh, grass. Thank you, neighbors, whoever you are. Um, but I have to pinch myself that I'm actually riding this. I have, I don't know. I follow Harley very closely and like what they release as far as models go and I knew that this was something that was in the works but I never thought I'd have the chance to actually ride it and now I here I am I'm sitting on the freaking bike and riding it oh this is not the best intersection in the world mm, you're turning hopefully you're turning Ooh. It takes some getting used to, like, I want to put my feet <laughs> out here. <laughs> oh. So welcome to the back roads of Waukesha County, Milwaukee area. <laughs> so cool. Would I ride this bike again? Absolutely. Absolutely. freaking lutely Do I have about 30 grand to spend on it? Probably not. <laughs> I wish I did. God, I wish I did. I still want to get, so I don't know if you've seen the e-bikes that Harley has too, but I want to get my son and daughter one of those bikes, probably thinking for Christmas. I haven't really confirmed this with my husband yet, so husband, if you're watching this, sorry. <laughs> But I think it would be super cool for them to have it and for us to just have one of those bikes. Be cool. But oh, for me, it's like, I don't know, it, it comes so natural after you get on it for a little bit. <laughs> the one thing I do love about my Harley and my Sporty is just like the sound that comes with it too. But I guess the more you ride it and you ride this one, they're like two completely different bikes, but I enjoy both of them. Like I kind of enjoy the quietness and the stillness of this bike right now. Especially back on those like country roads too. It's kind of nice. But I suppose, I don't know how long I've been out on the bike, probably about half an hour now. Should return it back, but absolutely loved this. If you have not had a chance to ride one of these babies, definitely check it out if there's one local dealership that has these bikes. So I am in Milwaukee, Wisconsin course home of Harley Davidson and Milwaukee Harley Davidson dealership has one of these bikes to test ride and <laughs> it's just I can't believe I'm doing this <laughs> it's so cool so cool to be a part of that history 
that legacy that's happening and the things that are changing in this industry just to be a really small part in getting a chance to ride these machines I think for me that's like the the best feeling plus the bike is just super comfortable so comfortable like I said besides my leg placement <laughs> I don't really have much to say except I'm just listening to the kind of like a little whine a little whistle to the bike definitely torquey like you don't realize how fast you're truly going on it but it's incredible so again, thank you. Shout out to Milwaukee Harley Davidson for allowing me to do this. Oh, you have absolutely made at least my day, my week, my month, most likely my year <laughs> with doing this today. I love pushing myself just a little bit more outside of my comfort zone. And this was one of those that was on my checklist that I knew I wanted to wanted to tackle and wanted to check off that list so if anybody else has done it I'd love to hear your comments below just to get your thoughts on it what you loved what you didn't love about it I don't want to get into the whole gas electric I'm, I'm not a very strong political person that has swayed one side or another but just the growth in the motorcycle industry and coming up with new concepts and new bikes to ride I I am just in awe of it all so but yeah I suppose back to the city we go So I was also told by a friend, um, she's actually one of the engineers at Harley-Davidson, but kind of gave me advice on riding the bike. So when you're engine braking, just kind of touching the, the brake just so that you let other riders or drivers around you know that you are braking because you don't have to do <laughs> just, just to be on the cautious side, which that makes complete sense. Um, riding it but they, I know there are some people out there that just completely give it on this bike just to see how fast it can truly go and I am not not one of those people I'll pull it up so you can actually hear nothing of the bike <laughs> it's so quiet so stealthy I feel so fun and cool on this bike. I don't even know, do I need to be holding in the brake? Probably not. <laughs> All right, back to Milwaukee Harley Davidson, you go. Sad day. It's like I've made a new friend and I don't want them to go home, <laughs> but they have to go home. <laughs> Until next time. That wasn't beeping at me, I hope. Feel it pulsing just a little bit. So I was out for mm, just under half an hour, and it's at 88%. It's about 20%. I'm gonna have to look into how long the life of the battery actually lasts. I'll put it in the video here once I do my research. But 
here we are. Back at Harley. I'm gonna put you back right where you found them. Ta-da! Done. I kind of feel sad. Like I don't want to get off of it. Okay. At least my bike is still here. Next to the beautiful sport glide that's still here. Or rogue. Oops. Rogue glide. Sorry. I should know my bike's better. You are a street light. <laughs> so fun. Thank you, Milwaukee. Harley Davidson. Alright, until next time. I'm going to sign off. But thanks so much for riding. It's definitely an experience for me. And I'm glad I was able to take you guys along for the ride. So... Until the next one, ride safe guys, if you can see my reflection.